Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Lee Golden. Now, the military general that was basically going to be pushing Operation War Speed basically is saying there's going to be forced vaccinations and they want everyone to get vaccinated. So, I would like to have the Trump supporters uh, please try to, try to justify this. So, let's do it. What we're doing to make sure that... Um that we are ready uh, at this level after working these details for the last six months. Uh, as I've told the team, two things we must have. One, upon uh, emergency use authorization, uh, all of America must receive vaccine within 24 hours, as I said. All Americans must receive a vaccine within 24 hours? Or you'll do what? Or what? Does that sound like a free society? Wow, U.S. military, just wow. We, America has officially become communism under Trump. Mm. I think this is incredibly important. Fair and equitable distribution of the vaccine throughout the country simultaneously. There is no haves and have-nots. It is an equitable distribution, uh, and we are driving hard to make sure that that happens. So, this is, I mean, a lot of people are saying, I was saying it, Trump is going to force, the military is going to force vaccines on the population. People are like, no, 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 no. But now the high general says they are. And guess what? When they say there's going to be no yes or no, so I took the vaccination, is going to be, you're going to take it or else. AKA, you can't buy, trade, or sell unless you take the mark of the beast. You can't go to work unless you get vaccinated. You can't shop unless you get vaccinated. You can't travel unless you're vaccinated. This military is becoming tyrannical. Because it wants to do the will of the vaccine companies, Big Pharma, Dr. Fauci, or fake-ass Fauci, and Bill Gates. So we can all make China happy. So now the military is now submitting to the will of China and the vaccine companies. This country is fucked. Let's continue. The second thing that we want to do is make sure that the cadence of vaccine delivery following the first push is routine so that states slash jurisdictions can plan for it uh, and account and develop execution of the administration in a routine method so that the population is well informed. Uh, well, too bad they're not well, well informing the, the population on the matter. So there you go. The military is now going to force every citizen to get vaccinated. So Trump supporters, where were you on this? I spoke up against this many times, and people got mad at me saying, no, the military is not going to force you. Well, out of the horse's mouth, they're going to force you. Ha <laughs> ha, called it, called it, called it. So since you motherfuckers would like to uh, have Trump as president, thanks to Trump, now every president in the future can use the military to force vaccinate the whole entire population. So that, that makes the military an enemy of the republic. Because we have to listen to a bunch of non-doctors. Isn't that nice? America is officially dead, ladies and gentlemen. So my name is Seagull. Subscribe and like my videos. And have a good one. <laughs>